every year are stolen and then set alight, but there's a new weapon to catch the arsonists. As South Falkland's been finding out, it's a robotic camera with a little something extra. Fireproof, bulletproof and bombproof, they're normal habitats of the trouble spots of Northern Ireland. What makes these CCTV cameras so useful is that they don't need a hydraulic platform and a whole team of people to get them up. In fact, the whole process takes just five minutes. I think they'll have quite an impact um, in as much as once people, once the, the offenders realise that we've, we've got the capability to move from one area to the, to the other quite quickly, I think they'll we'll be pushing them elsewhere or try and, obviously try and stop them doing it all together. The real beauty of this system though is that you can download images from the cameras in real time onto your laptop. Or one of these, which can be hidden away inside the pocket of a passing firefighter or police officer. Between April and August of this year, there were five times as many arson attacks on cars as houses in the West Midlands. The Pauls live in former miners' cottages in Dudley in the Black Country, the area chosen to pilot the cameras. They reckon they get a car dumped and sat alight in the surrounding woods every fortnight. Well, I wish I could stop them, to be true. So the cameras would be a fantastic idea. Uh, we'd say yes to that. So I'm catching who's doing it on the yeah. the mayor. If they prove their worth during the three-month trial, they could be calling up a lamppost near you soon. Sarah Falkland, BBC Midlands Today in Hansworth in Birmingham.